By studying the properties of the light reflected by asteroids and meteorites, scientists can learn about their composition and physical properties without the need for physical samples. Meteors can be classified into two main types based on their composition, stony and iron. Stony meteors are composed primarily of silicate minerals, while iron meteors are composed primarily of iron and nickel. Stony meteorites are the most common type of meteorite, making up approximately 94% of all meteorite falls. They are typically composed of olivine, pyroxene, and feldspar, and can be further classified into chondrites and achondrites. Chondrites are primitive meteorites that have not been modified by heating or melting, while achondrites have been modified by heating or melting. Iron meteorites are much rarer than stony meteorites, making up only about 5% of all meteorite falls. They are typically composed of iron and nickel, and can be further classified into hexahedrites, octahedrites, and ataxites. Hexahedrites have a cubic crystal structure, while octahedrites have an octahedral crystal structure. Ataxites have no visible crystal structure and are thought to have formed at the core of a planetary body. Meteors and meteorites can also impact other celestial bodies, such as the Moon and Mars. Impact craters on the Moon and other planets provide important clues about the history and evolution of the solar system. The study of impact craters can also provide valuable insights into the geology and composition of other celestial bodies. One of the most famous meteor impacts in recent history occurred in 2013, when a meteor exploded over Chelyabinsk, Russia, releasing energy equivalent to 500 kilotons of TNT. The explosion caused widespread damage and injuries, highlighting the potential danger of meteor impacts on Earth. To study the effects of meteor impacts, scientists use a variety of methods, including numerical simulations, laboratory experiments, and field observations. By studying the effects of meteor impacts, scientists can learn about the processes that occur during impact events, including the formation of impact craters and the release of energy. In conclusion, meteors and meteorites are fascinating celestial bodies that provide important insights into the formation and evolution of the solar system. The study of meteorites can also provide valuable insights into the origins of life on Earth. Meteor impacts on other celestial bodies provide important clues about the geology and composition of other planets and moons and can also provide important information about the processes that occur during impact events. As our understanding of meteors and meteorites continues to grow, we can look forward to even more exciting discoveries in the future. Meteorites contain a variety of metals and minerals that are rare on Earth, including iridium, palladium, and platinum. These metals are valuable in many industrial applications, including electronics, catalytic converters, and fuel cells. One example of the potential uses of meteorites is the use of the metal iridium in the manufacture of hard disk drives. Iridium is a rare and expensive metal that is difficult to obtain on Earth, but is relatively common in some types of meteorites. By extracting iridium from meteorites, manufacturers can reduce their reliance on terrestrial sources of the metal. Another potential use of meteorites is in the manufacture of jewelry and art. Meteorites have a unique appearance and are prized by collectors and enthusiasts for their rarity and beauty.